Hello everyone, Campbell Marshall, KPRC Channel 2 Meteorologist on your mid-Sunday morning. We see overcast skies. We'll see a lot of that this afternoon with showers and thunderstorms, scattered showers and thunderstorms. This is exact, exact track radar showing what I'm talking about here. Just developed uh, within the last uh, hour or so this morning going into 9 o'clock hour. And when you look at these thunderstorms, they're developing pretty quickly and they develop pretty strongly and continuing to move to the south. Uh, from the south to the north and east. So we will continue to see that throughout the day. We'll have scattered showers and thunderstorms, and I'll show you our futurecast model to show you what I'm talking about. Where they happen, uh, there is a heavy rain presence there. Now, an inch or two within an hour as it moves on through. The good news is for these, they've been moving enough. We haven't had to have any aerial flood advisories, but that could happen throughout the day today, depending on where these storms happen to fall. So keep that in mind. Keep that umbrella handy with you. You look at a broader picture here. The flow from the south continues to bring that moist air all the way up, interacting with some of the mid-level elements to give us these showers and thunderstorms in the central part of the state as well. That area could very well provide a lot of moisture that will impact our area to the north as we go to the evening overnight hours as well. So we'll keep an eye on that. Eric Braid will be here through the evening hours and keep, keep you up to date on that. Here's a future cast model showing 10 o'clock uh, this morning, showing a noon, showing a, a much more widespread scattered thunderstorm presence uh, as of noon. Then this afternoon at 2 o'clock, still there. You notice by 5 o'clock, we see these storms really decreasing in. And, and uh, intensity and in number, but we'll see a trend continuing through the next day or so. Going in tomorrow morning, a Monday morning, look at Brenham showing some of the storms that are still there. There's a chance for that, just a slight chance. The models aren't really in total agreement of that, so we'll just keep an eye out for that. Going into Monday, we'll have uh, scattered showers as well, fewer scattered showers than we have today. Still, there is a chance for some of that to happen on Tuesday as well. Not much of a chance, but it's still there. Looking ahead to today, your high temperature about 90 degrees of Bush Intercontinental, 91 at Brenham, 92 in Columbus. You notice down to the south, Angleton, 90 degrees, Galveston, 87 degrees for your high. Going to be close to 90 today with the rain chances going up as we go through the afternoon. You look at the 10 day forecast, decreasing rain chances over the next several days. Also, higher chances for higher temperatures, mid to uh, mid temperatures, mid 90 temperatures here. A 30% chance. I didn't put any rain chances in for Tuesday, but there is a chance for that to happen as well. Through the end of the week, we start to see rain chances pick up again as we get into next weekend. Slight chances. The models, once again, aren't in agreement on that either. The news today is keep that umbrella handy, drink plenty of water because the heat index may be quite high on this Sunday. Enjoy.